If you've ever wondered what happens between the time a buyer finds a home and the day they own it, Stuart Title is here to help. In this video, we'll explain the basic steps of the home closing process to help you better understand what happens after the sold sign is posted. To start the process, the seller and buyer must reach an agreement to close. This includes signing an escrow contract and making an earnest money deposit. Now, the real estate agent will contact the title company and submit a title order. Next comes the title search and examination. This step is important as it eliminates playing the guessing game. The title company performs a search of public and non-public records including deeds, mortgages, paving assessments, liens, bills, divorce settlements, and anything else that could possibly affect the transfer of the title from the seller to the buyer. After the title search is cleared and completed, the next step is document preparation. Here, the title company will review legal and loan documents, assemble charges, prepare the closing disclosure, which outlines all the costs for the buyer and seller associated with the closing, and set a closing date. Next up is the actual settlement or closing. This is overseen by the escrow or settlement officer and is when all the paperwork is signed either in person or remotely with the digital closing, depending on your transaction type, location, and circumstances. The seller signs the deed over to the buyer, and the buyer signs their new mortgage and various other documents. Finally, to complete the process, the buyer is given their title policy and the keys to their new home. The seller will receive the payout of any remaining net funds, and all documents from the transaction are recorded with the county to show transfer of ownership. If you're still wondering about the closing process or just simply want more information on title insurance and Stewart Title, visit Stewart.com.